Hey, what's up guys? It's Eric from Easel Bros 3D Printing. I'm Carl, also from Easel Bros 3D Printing. And 3D printing and drones, or more specifically multi-copters, have been some of the most high-profile technological developments in the news recently. So we'll be going over the pros and cons of 3D printing your multi-copter frame. And so we'll start out with some pros. The first pro is going to be customizability. With 3D printing your frame, you have an immense amount of customizability. You can match your frame colors to your prop colors and to your other component colors. Also along those lines, you can design specific parts for your 3D printed frame. Once you have those digital models, you can exactly dimension and design your parts to exactly fit into your build. And so another advantage is cost. You may not think that 3D printing is cheap, and I'm going to be honest, it is not cheap, but compared to some other frames, 3D printing can be a lot cheaper. For example, the Zool, the Hovership Zool, a actual development of this 3D printed frame right here is $125. So 3D printing your frame can be more cost effective. When you do break your quadcopter, which will most likely happen if you're a beginner flyer, then you can easily replace the broken parts if you do 3D print your frame. And finally, there's the experience. Going from digital design to 3D printed model is a very interesting process and a very rewarding process. And along those lines, if you have a specific design in mind, you can go into CAD and design your frame for a specific payload or a specific purpose and 3D print your frame exactly how you want it. And so there are going to be some cons along with 3D printing your frame. Uh, you can get a carbon fiber kit from a retailer and this is going to be more robust than a 3D printed frame and it will also break less often. Along those lines, a carbon fiber frame will have higher performance. So it'll be stiffer, it'll have more predictable PID controls. And so if you're really trying to take your multi-copter to the max, a carbon fiber frame is the way to go. Not to say that uh, 3D printed frames are weak. For example, we did earlier did a torque test on a tubular arm design and that arm was able to hold 17 kilograms. However, when you look at the models between comparing carbon fiber and 3D printed parts, carbon fiber will win out. It is much stiffer. And finally, there is a carbon fiber look. If you really like that supercar woven carbon fiber look, carbon fiber frame is the way to go. It will look, have that high performance look to it. So thanks for watching guys. That's it for today. If you like this video, be sure to like it. Subscribe for more videos. We do have more material views in the making. Thanks for watching.